This is before I had any surgeries. This is in the very beginning. During her childhood. This page is prior to anesthesiology coming in before surgery. Alexa Nixon was more familiar with surgeons than swing sets. I just look hopeless. She spent more time in the pediatric unit than the playground. I was filled with hope, but I just don't look hopeful. When she was 11, Alexa was racked by seizures. An MRI revealed a brain tumor the size of a ping pong ball. That's me right out of surgery, but it would be the first of six brain surgeries. Waking up out of surgery, I couldn't move my left side at all. During her long recovery, caregivers left a deep impression on Alexa. I was very intrigued and I did ask a lot of questions to the nurses that took care of me um, because I realized I like this is something that I might want to do one day. So Alexa set a goal. A lot of studying. When we first met Alexa in 2016, the Chesterfield native was working toward her degree. VCU Children's Hospital, I would love to work there. That's my dream right now. I was holding my prayer bunny. You would understand if Alexa wanted nothing to do with hospitals. <laughs> Today, mm -hmm. it's where the 26-year-old feels most comfortable. I know I am, where I am is where I'm supposed to be. Alexa works in the neuroscience department at VCU Medical Center as a nurse, the same unit where she spent so much time as a child. It's my destiny, and each day I go to work, I get to live out my destiny. Alexa sees herself in the faces of patients she cares for. Sometimes it hits a little close to home, but it makes me that much more driven. She credits her faith, family, and friends with helping her recover and reach her goal. She is what you would imagine as the most trusted profession. What people look to as a nurse, that's Alexa. Fellow nurses Jillian Phillips and Morgan Knowles yeah. say their colleague possesses intangibles you just can't learn in a classroom. Oh, definitely. Yeah. I think she definitely was one of those people that was like made to be a nurse and be there for other people. She is embarking on a calling more than a career. If in some freak world, like nursing was not a paid profession, it would be my hobby. Alexa Nixon, a one-time patient. Especially where I am right now. Realizing her dream of helping others while exchanging her hospital gown for scrubs. I obviously want to grow as a nurse and grow in leadership, but I never want to leave the bedside because the patient relationship is why I'm here. Well, as you heard, I have been following Alexa's journey now for four years and she has never wavered. When I met her four years ago, she was a 21, 22-year-old, and uh, she said she always wanted to be a nurse, and now she is. Wow. And where she wanted to be. I mean, you get that calling and pursue it. You know, when I mean, you might set some plan, but then something happens to you, and that is just, that's incredible. And she's a lucky girl. Not too many people get to follow their dreams like that and to live out, I mean, their passion and walk in their destiny like she knows she's doing. Indeed, and survive six brain surgeries as well. The, the amazing thing is she's also working with some of the nurses and doctors who helped save her life, too, and wow. she calls them family. <laughs>